Hello everybody, I'm Scott Stevenson and I'm here with Chris Eirich. Chris, exciting news at the Xerox camp. We got two new entries into the portfolio, the Xerox Color J75 and C75 systems. This is the J75. Can you tell us what market it's catering to or who would be interested in a J75? Yeah, absolutely. So the Xerox Color J75 press is going to fit well in commercial print environments, in plan or inter enterprise environments, as well as quick print or even folks that are new to digital mm -hmm. or looking to migrate offset applications. This printer here now prints at 75 pages per minute, which is an upgrade from the printer it's replacing, the 770 press. Ah, by five pages a minute more, plus a few other things that we're going to address right now. First, let's really quick get over it. Color management, it's really important. Does this have color management technology in it? Absolutely. We're continuing with our ACQS, or the Automated Color Quality Suite technology. Gives you two very, very important things. One's going to be automated calibration, give you color consistency, and then automated profiling, which is going to get you accuracy. And those two things are important. And we're the only ones in the industry, Scott, that do it in line. Mm -hmm. So that automated inline not only saves you money, it reduces errors and alleviates bottlenecks, and it really makes migrating offset applications to digital easy. Wonderful. There's some other pieces that really are troublesome to this product class, and that's fusing technologies. A lot of fusers coming in and out. They wear out sooner than they should. How is Xerox addressing that? We've added some intelligent fuser tracking technology, and so it's very, very simple. Uh, essentially, on the fusers, we put something on here that allows you to designate the paper size that you're using. Okay. So once you put that fuser in, if there is a mismatch mm -hmm. between your application and the fuser setting, it's going to let you know. Okay. And so that mitigates any errors in printing. So de dedicated fusers for different paper sizes Absolutely. to minimize the wear yep. and actually extend the life of the fuser. Exactly. There's another big feature. I read about this earlier. You've got to confirm this for me. There's a simple image quality adjustment feature going on in here. It sounds rather simple, but it's very important. Can you tell me a bit more about that? This is a game changer, and here's why. The issue that customers have had previously is that if the machine is misregistered or they're having density uniformity issues, yeah. it required a call to a technician. It's not just our products. Mm -hmm. This is an industry-wide issue. Mm -hmm. So what we've added is even more automation to the system to make it simple so that even an operator can adjust alignment, registration, mm -hmm. and density uniformity themselves. So in five minutes or less, you're rocking and rolling with business cards and postcards, which actually do require that critical registration front to back. Yeah, so that's being done automatically. So you recognize you have a problem, you'll just take that, sh that, that form, scan it in, and it's then... Well, yeah, it's extremely simple to do. The way that it's done is you go to the user interface here and you're printing off a test target which you're going to scan in with the scanner. Yep. Once those values are in, I go over to my PC application yep. for the simple image quality adjustment and I start the registration process and it automatically adds those values here for custom stocks to it. Wow, work. that's really important when you're running a paperweight of up to 300 GSM at rated speed front to back. That's a big value add. It's absolutely, and it's the same process for the density uniformity. Wow, that's good. Chris, the last piece is remote services. That's new for this product. Can you explain a little bit more detail what remote services consist of? Yeah, Scott, this is all about uptime for our customers. So we add three very critical features to this press. One is automated supplies replenishment. So when you need toner, we get it to you. Mm -hmm. The other one is automated billing and reporting. So you spend more time working on high value jobs and less time trying to track down numbers and send them into Xerox. And the third, and another critical feature, is that automated maintenance assist. So if there's a problem with this machine, mm -hmm. your service rep is gonna get an email. And that's about Xerox being more proactive with you, simplifying the way that you do business with us. Wonderful. Listen, Chris, thank you very much for taking the time today. It's been a wonderful insight. Thank Thanks. you so much.